Coding failures and defects. Coding failures and defects. Abrasion. Probable causes. Removal of a portion of the surface of the coating or, in severe cases, removal to expose the substrate by contact with another object, such as the use of metal chains for lifting, cargo, fenders, or the grounding of a ship. Prevention. Use of abrasion-resistant coatings formulated with particular regard to resins and extender pigments. With severe cases of abrasion, the effects will be reduced or limited only by an abrasion-resistant coating. Adhesion failure. Probable causes, surface contamination or condensation, incompatibility between coating systems, or exceeding the overcoating time. Prevention, ensure that the surface is clean, dry, and free from any contamination and that the surface has been suitably prepared. Use the correct coating specification and follow the advised overcoating time. Alligatoring, crocodiling. Probable causes, internal stresses in the coating where the surface shrinks faster than the body of the paint film. Excessive film thickness and limited paint flexibility. Application of a hard top coat over a more flexible softer undercoat. Application of top coat before the undercoat has dried. Prevention, use correct coating specification and compatible materials. Avoid excessive film thickness. Avoid application at high ambient temperatures. Bleeding. Probable causes. Bleed through is generally a full or partial redissolving of the previous coat or an ingredient of a previous coat and can occur when strong solvents are used in the top coats. Prevention. Use correct coating specification and materials. Use compatible materials. Use appropriate seal or coat if possible. Blistering. Probable causes. Many mechanisms can be involved including osmotic gradients associated with soluble salts, soluble pigments, corrosion products, retained solvents, and solvents from cargoes. Non-osmotic blistering is associated with cathodic desponding, thermal gradients related to cold wall effects, and compressive stress. Prevention, ensure correct surface preparation and application. Apply a suitable coating system after testing for soluble salts. Consider the possibility of the different blister mechanisms in the particular environment. Bloom, blush. Probable causes, paint film exposed to condensation or moisture during curing, especially at low temperature, common phenomenon with amine-cured epoxies. Incorrect solvent blend can also contribute to blooming. Prevention, apply and cure coating systems under correct environmental conditions and follow the manufacturer's recommendations. Bridging probable causes, poor application. High viscosity paint system. Failure to brush paint into corners and over welds. Prevention, brush apply a stripe coat into corners and welds and fill all cracks or weld them prior to application of the full coating system. Bubbles or bubbling. Probable causes, trapped air slash solvent within the coating that is not released before the surface dries. Air entrainment during mixing. High ambient temperature during application. Also seen when overcoating and defouling without removal of the leached layer and zinc silicates. Can be found with factory applied coatings where application is by dipping, electro deposition or roller coating. Prevention, in spray application, adjust viscosity with thinners and follow data sheet requirements for maximum application temperature. Use correct mixing equipment to ensure air is not stirred in during mixing. Apply a mist coat. Add defoaming agent to emulsion paints. Cathodic desponding. Probable causes, high over voltage principally from impressed current systems but also to a lesser extent with sacrificial anodes when the number of anodes is excessive. Factors are incorrect installation, poor monitoring, and incompatible coating systems. Prevention, use a well-designed cathodic protection system, regularly monitored with well-placed reference electrodes, and application of an alkali-resistant coating system. Chalking probable causes, disintegration of the paint binder on exposure to weathering and or ultraviolet light. Prevention, apply a suitable top coat with high resistance to chalking and with ultraviolet resistance. Checking. Probable causes. Typically a formulation and or a specification problem. As with cracking, stresses are developed that cause the surface of the paint film to become brittle and crack. Limited paint flexibility. Prevention, use a correctly formulated coating system. Sissing. Probable causes, surface contamination by either moisture or foreign matter such as oil, grease, or silicone. Also known to happen when incorrect solvent blends have been used. Prevention. Ensure surface is clean and free from grease, oil, and other contaminants prior to application of coating. Cobwebbing probable causes, too high a viscosity with some types of polymer solutions. Will occur with chlorinated rubber at almost any viscosity. Prevention, reduce the spraying viscosity. 
Select a more suitable solvent blend. Change the spraying conditions. Cracking. Probable causes. Cracking is generally a stress-related failure and can be attributed to surface movement, aging, absorption and desorption of moisture, and general lack of flexibility of the coating. The thicker the paint film, the greater the possibility it will. Crack. Prevention. Use correct coating systems, application techniques, and dry film thicknesses. Alternatively, use a more flexible coating system. Cratering. Probable causes. Trapped air or solvent bubbles that have burst, leaving small craters as the coating dries. The coating has insufficient time to flow into a uniform film. Prevention. Improve spray technique. Apply a mist coat, and avoid air entrainment during mixing. Add thinners as recommended by the paint supplier. Crazing probable causes, application temperature too low, incompatibility with previous coating, aging, or high film thickness. Prevention, apply a thinner coat of paint, add slower drying solvent, check that application and drying conditions are correct for the paint system used, and check compatibility. Cross footing. Probable causes, usually due to the surface drying rapidly to form a skin, which then wrinkles as solvent slowly evaporates from the soft underlying paint. Prevention, apply a thinner coat of paint, add slower drying thinners, and check that application and drying conditions are correct for the paint system used. Delamination. Probable causes, provided that compatible paint materials have been used, delamination defects are generally related to poor surface preparation and application defects, such as contamination between coats, exceeding overcoat times, or application to a glossy surface. Prevention, ensure that no contamination occurs. Between paint coats. Follow the recommended overcoating intervals. Lightly abrade and clean glossy surfaces between coats. Fading probable causes. Incorrect pigmentation. Use of non-light stable organic pigments. Atmospheric contamination. Porous substrate. Prevention. Use correct coating systems that resist ultraviolet light and fading. Use a coating with light stable pigments. Flaking. Probable causes. Incorrect paint system used. Either no or an incorrect prairie treatment used for certain substrates, for example, non-ferrous or galvanized. Also poor application techniques. May also be attributed to differential expansion and contraction of paint and substrate, for example, wood. Can be the result of aging of the paint system. Prevention, use correct coating system and. Prairie treatment. Grinning probable causes, low film thickness of top coat. Poor opacity and covering power of top coat. Strong color of primer slash undercoats. Prevention, apply adequate dry film thickness between individual coats. Use opaque coatings with good opacity. Heat damage probable causes, effect of high temperature often applied to the reverse side of a steel plate from burning, welding, or fire. Prevention, ensure that all welding slash burning is completed prior to painting. Impact damage. Probable causes, impact damage to a relatively brittle coating often seen on glass fiber reinforced plastics. Also occurs when steel is deformed by impact. Prevention, prevent impact damage. Inner coat contamination. Probable causes, the contamination could be present due to inadequate washing down, salts from weathering of shop primer, or deposits from nearby operations. Prevention, carefully inspect and test the surface before paint application, and wash down with fresh water if required. Mud cracking. Probable causes, generally, over-application of heavily pigmented primers such as inorganic zinc silicates or water-based coatings, although can occur with other over-thick systems. Prevention, apply only the recommended coating thickness. Use recommended application techniques with suitably formulated products. Orange peeling. Probable causes, failure of the paint film to flow out. Usually caused by poor application techniques, incorrect solvent blend, or too high thick entropy. Prevention, use correct application techniques with suitably formulated products. Peeling probable causes, peeling is the reduction in bond strength of the paint film due to contamination or incompatibility of coats. Prevention, use correct coating system and specification applied to clean and uncontaminated surfaces. Pinholes. Probable causes, solvent or air entrapment within a paint film. A common problem when coating porous substrates such as zinc-filled primers, zinc silicates, and metal sprayed coatings. Pinholes can also be caused by incorrect spray application or incorrect solvent blend. Prevention, use correct application techniques with suitably formulated products, correct solvent blends and environmental conditions. 
Check spray equipment and distance of spray gun from the surface. Apply a mist coat. Rippled coating. Probable causes. Strong wind blowing across the surface of wet paint causes it to ripple. Where this occurs on the underside, the ripples can hang down in the form of small stalactites. Can also be caused by poor application techniques. Prevention. Do not apply paint under unfavorable conditions. Use correct application equipment and workmanship. Runs probable causes. Over application of paint, excessive use of thinners, incorrect, or lack of, curing agent, or poor workmanship. Prevention Use correct application techniques and apply at the recommended dry film thickness. Rust rashing probable causes low film thickness, often in combination with a high surface profile. Prevention Ensure that an adequate thickness of a primer coat is applied to cover the surface profile, and check that the surface profile is not too large. Rust spotting Probable causes, low film thickness, more likely creating rust rashing, voids and holidays, more likely creating rust rashing, but also defects in the steel, such as laminations and inclusions. Too high a surface profile may cause penetration of peaks through a paint film and cause rust spotting. May also occur from metallic contamination of a coated surface by grinding dust and so on. Prevention, ensure that an adequate thickness of a primer coat is applied to cover the surface profile. Use a thicker coating system or a lower blast profile. Protect coating from contamination with grinding dust and so on. Rust staining. Probable causes. Water runoff from a rusty surface above a soundly coated surface. Rust staining occurs when the rust is wetted out and contaminated water runs over and discolors other items or locations. Usually more of an eyesore than a defect. The coating itself may not be defective, only stained. Prevention. Ensure adequate design and suitable. Maintenance Sags Probable causes, over-application of paint, excessive use of thinners, incorrect, or lack of, curing agent, or poor workmanship. Could, in extreme circumstances, be a formulation problem. Prevention Use correct application techniques with suitably formulated products. Settlement Probable causes, old stock, heavily pigmented paint, and incorrect formulation of product can be a problem with zinc-rich primers. Prevention, use products within shelf life. Use adequate mixing procedures. Keep paint mixed or recirculated during spray application. Skinning probable causes, absence of anti-skinning agent, use of non-airtight container, hot storage conditions. Often occurs in partly used cans. Prevention, use airtight container, and store according to data sheet. Solvent lifting. Probable causes, incompatible paint systems used. Top coats with a strong solvent blend can react with previous and weaker solvent blended coatings. Overcoating before the previous coat is adequately hardened. Prevention, use correct coating specification, overcoating times, and materials. Conduct compatibility trials with undercoat slash topcoats. Solvent popping probable causes, incorrect solvent blends, porous surfaces incorrect environmental conditions, or high surface temperature. Prevention, use correct coating specifications and materials, and ensure correct application techniques and environmental conditions. Staining probable causes, contact with a solid or liquid that imparts a discoloration or stain to the coating. Prevention, avoid contact with solids and liquids that are prone to cause staining, or use dark colored coatings where any staining would not be so apparent. Stress cracking. Probable causes. Stress cracking can be attributed to surface movement, aging, absorption and desorption of moisture, thermal cycling, and general lack of flexibility of the coating. The thicker the paint film, the greater the possibility that cracking may occur. Often occurs around welds and changes in section. Prevention, use correct coating systems, application techniques, and dry film thicknesses, or use a more flexible coating system. Undercutting. Probable causes, application of paint to corroded substrate. Rust creep from areas of mechanical damage and missing primer coat. Can be found in areas of poor design or access, where inadequate preparation and coating thickness was applied. Could also be due to lack of maintenance. Prevention, use adequate coating specifications and maintenance procedures. Apply a suitably formulated primer. Wrinkling. Probable causes, usually due to the initial formation of a surface skin with solvent-based paints. Can arise from overcoating before the previous coat has adequately hardened. Over thickness, particularly with alkyd coatings. Prevention, 
use correct coating specification and materials, and ensure adequate mixing, application, and curing by following the paint supplier's recommendations. Please, support, and, subscribe. Comment which video you want.